In this video, we're going to talk about the order of operations. This is important because if you just start to solve a math problem from left to right, you will get the wrong answer. There's a, an acrostic to help you remember the order of operations called PEMDAS, which you may remember from grade school. And this stands for parentheses, exponents, multiplication, division, addition, and subtraction. And we can remember this with the helpful saying, please excuse my dear Aunt Sally. Now I've underlined multiplication and division because you don't do the multiplication and then the division. You do the multiplication and division together as you move from left to right, and you do the addition and subtraction together as you move from left to right. So one isn't prioritized over the other. But let's start to solve this problem. We start with the P, which is parentheses, and we only have one term here in parentheses, and that's 7 minus 4. So that's what we'll do first. So we still everything else, we'll just get carried down. But we saw what's in the parentheses, and obviously 7 minus 4 is 3. Our next step is to do exponents, which is, we only have one, and that is right here. So we just continue carrying down all the other terms. 2 to the third power is 8. Now is where the unique qualities of multiplication and division being together come into play. We have a division and we have a multiplication. You might see the M and think you should multiply first, but you don't. With multiplication and division, you work from left to right. So 56 divided by 8 is 7. And then we continue to carry through. 7 times 20 is 140. And now we only have one step left, and that is addition, and that gives us our answer of 143.